Welcome to Concept Craft. We are presenting step-by-step -step videos training to crack your certification exam. So you can gain the confidence to take on any accounting challenge. Now let's begin our today's lesson. Navigating your client's QuickBooks online company. Learning outcomes. In this lesson, we'll cover how to navigate your client's QuickBooks online company. Topics. Accountant versus business view. Navigation options. Dive into your client's data. Whether it's to review bank fee transactions, prepare financial reports, or support your clients, you'll need access to a wide range of financial data. How can QuickBooks Online help? QuickBooks Online brings everything you and your client need into one place. By navigating to your client's QuickBooks Online company through your QuickBooks Online account and user ID, you can access features and menu options that the client won't ever see. These features and menu options allow you to efficiently carry out bookkeeping only or accountant only tasks with ease. Accountant versus business view. In QuickBooks Online, there are two views, business and accountant. You can switch between them at any time. The main difference between the two views is their overall appearance. It's important to know that while the feature, menu, and button names are different, the actions you can take in each view are identical in most cases. However, in rare cases, some features are only available in one view and not the other. Select the tabs to find out more. Accountant view. As an accountant or bookkeeper, this is the view for you. It uses standard accounting language and gives you control over features like your client's chart of accounts and workflows that are aimed at the experts. You may choose to recommend your client also uses this view so that when discussing their accounts, you both see the same product navigation. Business view. Small business owners who use QuickBooks Online without the support of an accountant or bookkeeper might prefer the business view. It uses non-accountant terms, which makes it easier to manage accounts without learning complicated workflows or processes. It also allows clients to fully customize their left-hand navigation and hide or bookmark menu items and define their order. How to switch views. There might be times when you want to see your client's file in business view or to ask your client to switch to accountant view. Changing views doesn't affect your client's accounts or data. Here's how to make the switch. Select the gear icon. Select switch to business view or switch to accountant view. Navigation options. A QuickBooks online company is essentially made up of lists, transactions, and reports that represent the financial aspect of a business. As you know, this isn't as straightforward as some people might think. It's the story of a client's business. It records successes and disappointments, growth periods and downturns, who owes the client money, and what the client owes others. The easy-to-use navigation tools bring all this information together at your fingertips. Let's take a closer look. Select each hotspot to see further information. Plus New is the go-to button to quickly create or add transactions, from invoices to deposits. You can pay bills or even print checks. There are quick links for vendor or customer type transactions, as well as for employee activities and more general activities. The banking center is where clients connect bank and credit card accounts and or import transactions into QuickBooks Online as a method of tracking business transactions without having to manually enter them. The sales center is where clients can track invoices, set up payment links, and manage their list of customers or products and services. The cash flow center is where clients can view their past, present, and future cash flows. The chart here also provides clients with a real-time view of the current cash balance, along with a historical comparison of money in and out across all of the connected bank accounts. The expenses center is where clients manage a company's expense transactions and vendors. The projects center helps clients organize all the moving pieces of a customer project and provides insight into project profitability. The payroll center is where clients manage the company's payroll employees, independent contractors, non-employees, and vendors. The reports center is where clients find ready-made financial statements and or build customized transaction reports to analyze the financial performance of a company. The performance center that makes it easy to visualize company financial data is also accessed from here. The taxes center is where clients set up sales tax for the company, where applicable. The mileage center is where clients can record auto mileage. They can add trips manually or use the mobile app to do so automatically. Keeping an accurate annual mileage log ensures clients can easily enter mileage amounts in their tax returns. 
The accounting center is where clients access the company's chart of accounts and reconciliation center. The My Accountant menu is where clients can collaborate and share documents with you. The items in the Accountant Tools drop-down are only available to you as an accountant user. From here, you access a list of accountant-only tools to use when working on your clients' files. Among many others, it includes prep for taxes, reclassify transactions, voided slash deleted transactions, and write-off invoices. Some of these tools are available elsewhere, and some can only be found here. The gear icon is where your client can manage the company. It's also where you add users, change settings, and access most lists and tools. Summing up. Learning outcomes. Well done. In this lesson, we covered how to navigate your client's QuickBooks online company. Knowledge recap. Now, now you can navigate your way around your client's QuickBooks online and switch view if necessary. Next steps. In the next lesson, we'll look at reviewing financial data through the dashboard menu.